What's going on guys? So I'm back here with you with the PC that we built for gaming. Um, I did a video on this explaining all the componentry and everything. I'll put a card link up to it up here uh, above us and I'll also drop a link down in the description. You can step over to it and I list all these parts out with links of how we got all these and where we got them from and how we set it up. But what we're doing right now is I need to add a hard drive to this computer. Well, the problem of it is, is there's only two SATA plugs on this motherboard. Uh, we built this motherboard or built this computer with this motherboard with the intention of just running the game on it. But what we realized is that the system runs well enough that we can actually do screen capture with it too and get two different camera angles while both of us are playing. I'm on my computer and Bess on her computer and we can both screen capture at the same time when we're doing raids and stuff and we can share that information out there with you and the gaming public. So what I've got is a 500 gig uh, S, I've got a 500 gig hard drive that's 7200 RPMs, uh, it's a Hitachi series, that we're going to add in here with the solid state drive. And then what I'm going to do is go in into the Google configuration and set it up where all our screen capture goes over to it. But we didn't have a SATA port in the motherboard, so what the option that we had was basically to purchase one of these PCIe to SATA adapters. Um, we get this one out of the package here, and you'll see here, we've got our PCIe plug here, and then right here on the end, we've got two SATA plugs. So that's gonna allow me to utilize one of the unused PCE slots in the motherboard and actually run a SATA cable over and install this hard drive and hook it in and be able to read it through the computer. So let me get the camera positioned over here and uh, we'll get the cover plates and stuff loose and we'll actually get this card inserted and then we'll get the hard drive dock out, we'll get the hard drive installed and get everything wired up. All right guys, so first thing I'm gonna do is pop this screw out right here that's actually holding the bracket in place that holds our graphics card in. I'm gonna spin that out unlock that and we need to pull this metal clip out take it loose and then what we're going to do is we're going to take our PCIe card here and we're actually going to install it down into the motherboard ever so gently now let me forewarn you I'm no computer expert um, I work on things with a big hammer and if a big hammer doesn't work we get a bigger mm -hmm. hammer so uh, you'll just have to bear with me here I'm not the most delicate but that's got the card installed. So now, I'm gonna put our bracket back in place. And we'll put the screw back in it. There we go. All right. So there's that. Now that's got our PCIe card installed. I'm going to flip the system up here where you can see down in there. Our card's in. Our SATA plugs are right here on the back, so we should have access to those. And now what we need to do is we need to put a hard drive in. So spinning around here, where you can actually see it. This is our hard drive cradle down here that's got our SSD in it. I'm going to start out by taking the two screws out of it. Got those out. And this unit slides straight forward and pulls out. Now I'm gonna unplug the SSD here, just like that, and that gives me my cradle. Now what I need to do is mount my hard drive into this cradle. So this is a uh, 500 gigabyte hard drive it's not super big, obviously, by all means, but um, the SSD that's in there is only 240 gig, so that doesn't give us a whole lot of storage there outside of the game and the operating system. So what I wanna do is put this 7200 RPM hard drive in there and use it as a dedicated drive just for the screen capture. Now, I'm gonna get this set in here. We'll get everything lined up and put the screws in it. And then we'll attach our cable 
and we'll be ready to install this into the actual PC itself. Now, if you were doing a regular hard drive, I mean, this would be basically the same deal. You would just swap it out um, and reload your operating system, or if you could set it up and actually mirror it over, you could do that. Uh, really, it's just basically all we're doing to this system is just adding a single hard drive to it. And really, it's just like adding a big storage folder uh, that we're going to link all of our screen capture to. All right, so we got that set and ready. Now, this thing goes back in. It's got little tabs on it here. Um, you can see those right there. That's going to sit down in there and slide in place. But what we need to do first is actually hook up our SATA cable. I'm hoping that the one they sent us is going to be long enough. So we're going to run it under, come over, and we're going to snap that into our PCIe card over here. Well, if I can get my fat fingers in there, I reckon. There we go. All right, let me spin this around where you can see that. And you can see I got the cable plugged in right here. So we're plugged in, ready to go. Looks like it's gonna be plenty long enough to come over here and attach to our hard drive. So we're gonna come out, take our unit, Connect your power. There we go. Connect our power to our SSD. Connect our SATA cable back in for it. And then we get to set our cradle back in. Whoops. Got to reroute that. There we go. Okay. Now we can drop this back in. Put our tabs in place, lock it in, and then we just put our two screws back in. Guys, that's it. It's installed. The only thing I gotta do now is just hop over to the computer, uh, or hop over, plug this in, and get the computer up and running, and uh, that way we can go into the system, make sure that the hard drive is recognized. We'll do a quick format on it, and then we will be set and ready to go to utilize this as our storage drive for our screen captures. Um, that It's that simple, that quick. Uh, I am really thankful that they make that PCIe adapter. That's a lifesaver for sure. Uh, All right, that's it guys. That's got everything put together. We're set up, we're ready to go. We're gonna go plug everything in, fire this baby up, uh, go in, get all of our stuff formatted, and go ahead and transfer that file folder over so we can do all of our screen captures on that 500 gig hard drive and keep all that excessive memory taking up space uh, over on its own file folder, so to speak. So guys, be sure and stick with us. We're gonna be coming to you with more videos. Uh, I really appreciate y'all tuning in. Uh, it means a lot to us when you actually watch our videos, so we greatly appreciate it. Uh, when you subscribe, it's even great. Just gives us that motivation to create more videos for you. And by all means, give us a thumbs up, drop comments or questions down below. I'll do my best to answer questions. I'm no expert, but I'll try to help my community out in any way I can. Guys, thanks for tuning in.